we haven't built our tools that way. We haven't built our tools to serve the team leader who's trying to build more teams like the best teams. Our tools have been built to serve the organization. Our performance management, our employee engagement, our 360 tools, our learning management tools, even our selection tools are built to serve the organization. They're not built to serve that person who's running that blue dot up there or that white dot all over the place at the top right. I'll give you one example. We could take any example, but I'll take uh, one I know a fair bit about, employee engagement. Most employee engagement systems look like this. At the beginning of January, we take a file feed from the organization according to who reports to who boxes on an org chart. We lock that in, and then six weeks after that, we deploy our survey, whether it's 10 questions or 70 questions, we deploy our survey against the boxes on the org chart. Six weeks after that, the data comes back, broken out by the boxes on the org chart, and the first person to get the data is not the manager, it's the HR function. We get the data, we clean the data, we scrub the data, we find the patterns in the data, and then we hand the data off, again, not to the manager, but to the CEO, where we scrub it and decide that we're gonna put this in the town hall meeting or this in the newsletter, we're gonna say that communication went up and recognition went down and we do that and then we give the data to one level below the CEO and then finally probably three four months after the data was collected the poor manager whose data it is gets the data and the poor HR person is like well here's your data and the manager looks at the data and goes n equals seven but I don't have seven people on my team anymore. I have 10 people. Are the seven people part of the 10 people or is it entirely different seven? And the poor HR person is like I don't know just do your action plan and we'll come back next year and we'll do it again. That's Right? That's what employee engagement looks like, isn't it?